This is Matt from autogrow.co and in this video I'm showing you how to set up uh, a Vimeo video with a call to action that appears at the end of the video. So you come into our account here, you find the video that you want to apply it to and you click on the embed option right there and you're, you're able to see a preview of uh, you know what the video looks like um, by default, if it's a Mad Hacks video, these are the settings that you want to have turned on, as well as the ones that should be turned off. So play bar is on, meaning this. Volume, they can adjust the volume. Uh, sure, we can turn on the speed controls, meaning if they want to watch it on fast forward, that's fine too. Uh, full screen, yes. No like, no watch later, but yes for sharing it, no for embedding it. Uh, the profile picture and byline should be turned off. The title should be turned on. That's this right here. And you can see how it updates the preview as you make these changes here. Let users decide uh, for what displays or what doesn't. That should be turned off. Whoops. And let's see if we can customize the color to be like auto grow. Okay, so it's that color right there. And let's see what color that is in hex format. So that would be this. Let's go back to the editor. Let's pop that in right there. And there we go. So that's the default color that we should use in terms of we want to use our brand colors on the player so that it just looks consistent with our website. It's very professional. Okay, um, now for the actual call to action button, which is the primary focus of this video. Let me show the background image there. But uh, in this case, the call to action that we're setting up, and there may be separate rules that we'll come up with in the future for you know what call to action, what do we want to sell at the end of different videos, where do we want to link people to. But for right now, the call to action is for our sales funnel diagram pack. So we want to use this text, set up a successful sales funnel faster. You want to select, make sure that call to action is selected from the drop down here. Um, it should appear when the video ends. Right? I think that's the default anyway. Description, these 28 original funnel diagrams are treasure maps, quote unquote, that take your leads from point A to, point to buy now. Uh, the button link is linking to our sales page for that. The default text is learn more. And the secondary call to action link is just same link uh, or order, order a copy now. And if you make any changes, make sure to click update. Don't ask me why they ask you to update as well as click update as well as save. But in either case, click update and click save. And you are good to go. Now, when you're ready to embed it, just click on embed code and copy and paste. And that's how you set up a call to action at the end of a Vimeo video.